So there's a local actor out there who can be seen on HBO's new drama, The Gilded Age. Now, News 12 Connecticut, Sean McCabe has more with Ward K. Horton, who says that he shot the show at the height of the pandemic. I've always loved to play roles where I get to, you know, kind of play both sides of things and, um, you know, be a little bit devious and, uh, but earnest as well. Actor Ward K. Horton has made his home in Fairfield for the last 13 years while scoring TV and film roles, including the lead in horror hit Annabelle. Obviously, it makes some things a little bit more difficult, but at the end of the day, I come home to, uh, you know, a house where I have a little bit of space. Um, I just can breathe. I can kind of get away from the business. Horton was getting ready to shoot The Gilded Age for HBO in early 2020 when the pandemic hit. We were doing table reads and etiquette classes and all of that. And about a week before we were st supposed to start production, the world shut down. He says when production was finally ready to start on his scenes early the following year, pandemic precautions were still at their height. You were seeing sometimes seeing people really for the first time that you had actually ever spoken to them without a mask on when the cameras were rolling. Uh, which is really pretty crazy. The Julian Fellows drama is set in 19th century New York. Horton says preparing for his role as the wealthy Charles Fane included learning period table manners. We sat down for hours with uh, uh, some wonderful etiquette trainers of that time period who talked us through uh, what silverware to use, how to, who to talk to at the table. The show depicts the power struggle between New York's old elite and its new money. We underestimate the power that this new group of people has. Um, and uh, it, it turns out to bite, us, to bite us in the wrong place. <laughs> Sean McCabe, News 12, Connecticut. Sounds like a pretty good show, right? Yeah. So Horton made his debut on The Gilded Age this week. The show airs Mondays at 9 on HBO. I have to check that out.